All right. One more time, we are welcome to our class. This is Speedy Success Professional. My name is Femi Richard, and our topic of course today is Public Sector Accounting and Finance, PSF. And we're looking at preparation of vouchers, cash book, impress book, transcript, and other government accounts. And our target will be uh, on term, terms that will need to be defined, cash office and control, preparation of voucher, types of types of transcripts, the journals and its entry, how to treat loss of fund in government accounting. Uh, let's let's move up. I'd like you to know that this. Um, topic is going to have part one, two, and three. Please make sure you follow up to watch all. Let's go to terms. Um, the following terms are going to be discussed now. We're looking at cash office, cash control, transcript, voucher, and then let's go. Um, a number, a cash office is a place or a room where cash and bank transactions of any business including government, takes place. That's a simple definition of cash office. Don't forget cash is uh, cash on hand and demand deposits that is in the bank altogether. Then we move up to look, we move down to look at cash control. Cash control refers to the strings of coordinated actions that must be impacted upon in order to ensure that incomes that are accrued to an organization are received on a timely basis to prevent fraud and mismanagement of funds. And the example of bank cash control is telebanking. Are we together? Now let's move up and look at the rest um, definition. The next definition is transcript. Transcript is transcript is a statement of receipt and payment. And another writer can say it is the statement of income and expenditure. Uh, it is the final account of self and sub-self accounting units in government. It has three main types. Don't forget, the government is a non-profit making organization, and the best, uh, the major accounting type, the uh, finance statement they have is the receipt and payment, which is the same thing as what a cash book in normal private business. Voucher. Vouchers, uh, we can say voucher is a document showing payment or receipt of public funds. There are three main types of voucher. Payment voucher, receipt voucher, and adjustment voucher. I want to encourage you, make sure you don't miss the next video because it contains more of each of this information and we're going to demonstrate the practical part and do our calculations. Let's quickly run down with uh, functions of um, the cash office. Now let's look at that. The cash office has so many functions, but we're going to pick only seven of them. The first one is receipts, custody and disbursement of government fund. We, remember we are emphasizing government cash office here. Are we together? Number two, maintenance of proper book of accounts, uh, which are keeping complete and correct accounting records for the government office. Maintenance of adequate security over cash uh, or cash movement which includes building a very strong um, office room, well wall, uh, with frames and bars, uh, putting in mercury lights, counting machine, and um, daily banking ATC. Number four, there is maintenance of security books, e.g. cash booklets, certificates, and orders. Then we look at balancing of the cash book. It is done at the cash office. The next is preparation of bank reconciliation statement. 
which is very, very important and is mostly done either weekly or monthly as the entity may require. Um, ladies and gentlemen, when we meet the next class, we'll be looking at uh, some of the controls that, we, that is done on cash and then we move to um, other parts of the assignment, the lecture which includes preparation of voucher types of transcripts, journal and its entries, um, loss of uh, funds, how it is treated in government. My name is Femi Richward, Pastor Richward, a chartered accountant. Please call us or follow us on YouTube on Speedy Success Studio. You will see all of our videos. God bless you. Thank you.